Welcome to Reno Tahoe Adventures. I'm David Oliphant. And I'm Tiffany Story. And David and I are downtown enjoying the Reno River Fest. It's one of the few pro premier kayaking events and one of the few in such a great downtown setting. Reno and Tahoe have some of the most scenic outdoors anywhere. With literally thousands of acres and hundreds of miles of hiking trails, it's the perfect place to explore. There are dozens of day hikes and plenty of overnight hikes as well to experience the Tahoe Rim Trail. And over 50% of the trails are available to mountain bikes. Right here along Victorian Avenue is the beer house of the famous Icky, Great Basin Brewing Company. As they say, it's not yucky, it's Icky. Now this is what I call getting in touch with nature. Just you, your gear, and these cute little birdies. Come here, birdie. Wow, have I worked up an appetite. <laughs> is that my lunch? Um, well, it's part of your lunch, but don't worry, there's more in the bag. <laughs> I'm hungry. Well, you have oh. to try this. Look at David. Well, it's cute, but I'm still hungry. <laughs> <laughs> It's a good idea to pack some essentials, apparently including some extra food, whenever going into the backcountry, and make sure to get some advice and always set a plan. <laughs> it's really obvious who the experts are and who still needs to take a few more lessons. Located in Genoa, Nevada's oldest settlement, Wally's has been in operation since the 1860s. Riding along lakes and streams as well as our forested land makes for an incredible day. Hey, how's your ride going? Oh, I'm having a blast. This is my favorite adventure so far. It's pretty amazing. The Reno Tahoe area has some of the best rock climbing in the country. Donner offers everything from bouldering to single pitch bolted sport routes and multi pitch track climbing. Just across the lake is another great area called Lover's Leap. Regardless of your skill level, if you want to get up close and personal with Mother Nature, Hugging a rock wall is about as close as it gets. The Reno Tahoe area does have some of the best riding in the country. And if you have a license to ride, you can rent a Harley from the folks right here at Reno Harley Davidson. With plenty of pullouts and rest stops, you want to make sure you take full advantage of the view areas, especially as you approach Lake Tahoe. In addition to Squaw Valley's ice and right here at the rink on the river, other ice rinks also offer the chance to skate on metal. Hey, look at this one. I think he likes oh. me. Whoa, thank you. <laughs> That's right, sledding with the dogs. You know what, you don't have to travel all the way to Alaska to have this experience. You can go dog sledding right here in America's Adventure Place. That Ooh. felt great, George. Did you see where it went? I think that went in the pond, in the pond. again. <laughs> Numerous legends surround Wattel's activities at his Lake Tahoe estate, including some very colorful parties and high-stake gambling here in the card house. Starting this month, kayakers will fill the river and entertain crowds all summer long. And if you enjoy this excitement, Mother's Day weekend, there'll be hundreds of athletes and thousands of spectators all enjoying the Whitewater Park during the Reno River Fest. It's not every day you come down to Wingfield Park where we're used to seeing people kayak and today we're seeing people surf. Oddly enough, we're not used to seeing that. I'm interested in meeting this group of guys and getting my chance on the board. Oh, oh. There's a couple of ways to see the beauty, but the best way of seeing above Reno and Tahoe is wow. really by floating above it. Thank you, Kuhn. Wow. We end our sushi journey just a few blocks from where we started. Adjacent to the award-winning Golden Fortune Chinese Restaurant is the Eldorado Sushi Bar. They have an incredible selection of both hand rolls and sushi tempura. The marina is a popular water playground for both residents and visitors to Sparks. All right, I have to admit that wasn't my first shot off the tee, but if you haven't played this course before, it's a safe bet to save your mulligan till you get right here to the 15. And after our cruise, we're heading over to Shakespeare at Sand Harbor, and we'll have some other entertaining hot spots when we return. Getting into one of these boats and actually balancing, even in a calm pool area, really makes you appreciate what the pros go through. Tahoe in the summertime means Tahoe in the water. It sure does, and there are a variety of ways for you to enjoy America's Adventure Place. From renting a boat to enjoying a chartered sail, there's a lot of ways for you to enjoy your day on Lake Tahoe. Ooh. Including jumping in the water. 